Hello dear friends, in trick number 399, I am going to deal with the divisibility rule of 23. I don't think many of you must have heard of this kind of divisibility rules by such large numbers, but sometimes we require these tricks for finding the LCM and HCF of numbers wherein we have to find the factors. And whenever numbers are divisible by 23, it is quite difficult to identify. Now let us take one example, say we are taking the example of 115. Now what do we do in this case? First of all, just separate out the unit digit. So unit digit is 5 in this case. So what we do is, we write the remaining number 11 and then we take 7 times, now this 7 is the fixed quantity which we have to take. 7 times the unit digit and add it to the remaining number. So 11 plus 35 that becomes 46 and now you can see 23 into 2 is 46. 46 is clearly divisible by 23. So the entire number 115 is divisible by 23. So again what is the rule? Take 7 times the unit digit and add it to the remaining number. If the obtained number is divisible by 23, then the entire number is divisible by 23. Let's take some more examples. Say this time we have, I'll frame a question here. Okay, we have 345. Now let us check whether 345 is divisible by 23 or not. See the remaining number is 34 and add 7 times the units place. So this becomes 34 plus 35 which is 69 and clearly 23 into 3 is 69. So 69 is divisible by 23. So the entire number 345 is divisible by 23. Take one more example. So this time we have a larger number. I will just frame the question for you. Okay, we have 28382. Now we want to identify whether this number is divisible by 23 or not. So again, what we do is we take the remaining number leaving behind the unit place. So 2838 and add 7 times this number that is 14, 7 to the 14. Now this comes out to be 2852 and now apply the rule again because this number is quite large. So just as we did here, we can do it again. See here it becomes 285 and add 7 times to 14. So this becomes 299. Again this is large, so you can again do that. So 29 plus 7 times 9 is 63. So this becomes 92 and clearly 92 is 23 into 4. So the entire number this is divisible by 23. So you see students, you can repeat the, that step until you get a number which is easily identifiable whether it is divisible by 23 or not. And if the result is divisible by 23, the entire number will be divisible by 23. So, this is a very rare method of finding divisibility by 23. So, practice this and I am sure you will use this in questions of LCM, HCF and so on. So, if you like it, share the video and subscribe the channel.